Oh, that's fantastic. Thank you, sir. Cheers. Cheers. Hey, guys. Welcome to Tools on Tap. And today we're talking about a really cool knife from Kershaw. It's not your average knife. It's an automatic knife. I, I would it's call it a switchblade. I definitely would. Yeah. Um, it's called the Launch 6. And we're also going to talk about the Launch 4. It's a smaller knife. The Launch 6 is a 78, it's model number 7800 BLK. <clears throat> I'm assuming BLK is black. Black to um, It is a black anodized aluminum handled knife, uh, which makes it really light. 3.8 ounces. And and again, it's got this, um, it tells you right here, it's CPM 154 steel. And I had no idea what that was, but Josh does. I Googled it. Google it. All right, I'm a simpleton, so I like to kind of know what these fancy terms mean. Basically, it's saying that the, the edge of the, the blade, the, the, the materials that are made of, the carbides, the metals, it's going to ensure a little bit longer of, of a, a lasting blade and sharpness that you would, would may not typically get on it's your gonna average. It's going to hold knife. an edge longer. Right, yeah. right. I get it. Um, so, do, what do you think? Do you see anything? Did you notice this tip here? I just noticed this. It's you thinking glass break? I mean, uh, crazy if you don't try. I think it would absolutely I, I think smash in, a window in, if you want to, like if you're in a car and you dire circumstances. I'm going to go for whatever I can. Yeah, yeah. Tool of immediate means. Um, it's got a drop point blade, which I I like. I'm I'm a fan of that in the in the, uh, the uh, Tanto blade or whatever yeah. the shot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Drop point, drop point and Tanto are both different, but I I do like mm. this because it gives you that more cutting edge. It's almost four inches long. It's a little bit long or a little bit bigger knife for my everyday yeah, carry. Me as well. It, it's big. Four inch, a four inch blade alone is a lot of blade. Absolutely, but it's not heavy. It's light, it's 3.8 ounces. Uh, one thing I'll say about these knives, Kershaw knives in general, you've reviewed a bunch, I've reviewed yeah. a bunch. You did the blur, I was doing the Ken Onion. If you drop these knives, the, the ones with like the, the thumb assist. Oh yeah, yeah. Sometimes when you drop them, they open. Accidental deployment. Uh, so you got to be careful with that. I recently, Especially when wearing flip flops, when wearing flip flops, I recently uh, left my knife in my jeans and they went through the wash and they opened in the wash. And I've also had them open in the dryer, and that can be dangerous when you go in and reach out, reach for clothes. Never cut could, myself. Could, could add some ventilation to your clothing, though. <laughs> I mean, it's a popular you, look. Absolutely. Uh -huh. um, so uh, just got to be careful of that. It is an automatic blade. They did put that. Thing there with the, the, you notice that with the right, switch. Right, the, so. the, the button for the the uh, assisted. Yeah, the, uh, I the mean, deployment button. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, the auto button. lock or unlock um, is recessed, so it it's in line with your finish. Right, right. So you, even if you were to drop it, I mean, you would have to have like a pinpoint rock and drop it specifically on that Boom. that quarter inch button. So that to have it open, and I'm even I'm rubbing my fingers over it now. It's not <coughs> opening. You have to actually push it. So that is a good feature. I'm thinking Absolutely. that is safety. It's not gonna. I I, I believe that is very. You're feature. not gonna. <coughs> I mean, I'm trying it on the edge here, and I'm still not. It's still not opening. Yeah. So, um, I think that's pretty good. I will say one thing about this: the Launch Six. The lines are super sexy. Uh, it's blacked yeah. out. It's a black matte. It doesn't shine. Slim it's, and streamlined. Yeah, light. low profile. It's you're not you're not advertising. You're not telegraphing that you carry a knife. And the belt clip here, which is reversible. It is reversible. So if you're a lefty or righty, depending yeah, on what yeah. your dominant hand is, it sits low profile in your pocket, which I really mm -hmm. like. And you just talked about lefties. How's a lefty going? I mean, I open with my thumb. How's a lefty doing this? I, I, well, I'm not a lefty, but I'm going to imagine <laughs> my dad is. I'm going to go for your index yeah, finger. Yeah, they're doing index finger. going to be the same. Poor lefties. They, yeah. get, they get screwed on everything. It's just, there is a lanyard on this. Um, let's talk about price. We didn't mention price. Price, uh, 170 Oh. However, oh, however, there's oh. some, some, some news to be found. Uh, you, you Googlers, you Amazon uh, fanatics, uh, I found it for 108. Okay, all right. I will say this: for 100 bucks, I would buy this. Right. Um, mm, I'll tell you why. You, you, you're paying for the automatic, yeah. right? And you're paying for the aluminum and the finish. I mean, it, it's machined extremely nice. This is a sexy knife. It's sexy lines. It's light. It's durable. It's strong. It sits centered perfectly. It's first. got a um, these aluminum washers in here that. You can, yeah, it, it, it's smooth. It, it, it's spring. Avoids binding. Yeah, it just and there's a spring in it. It's real nice, easy to clean. There's not a lot of areas where gunk would get in here. Um, 
I'd pay a hundred bucks for this. I would. There's only one thing I really just not a fan of, and that was the whole mechanism of how it opened. When I was opening it, the the blade when it, it kind of has a little bounce to it. Um. Oh yeah, I see that. So uh, to exaggerate, it goes boing like that. Yeah, before it's fully locked, and it it it, it it's not apparent to to the, the naked eye if you're not unless you're looking for it. Yeah. But that's something I I look for. One thing I noticed, <coughs> I did I did notice that after you said it. I noticed that there's a tendency to open it and keep your finger depressing on the button. Just because it, it's a natural Yeah, because you're position. grabbing it. You've got to open it and let go of the button, otherwise you're not going to lock it. Right, it's, and that could be part of the, the, the problem the, yeah. you know, if you have an accidental deployment. Or. Um, <clears throat> well, I, I'm going to say a couple things. First of all, I love that it's made in the USA. In fact, they've got the Stars and Stripes, Stars facing forward into battle. So Loving that. So it's the only way to go. Um, <clears throat> I, I think... Um, I think for $100, this is well worth it. The clip is secure. It's a low profile, deploys well, it's fast. I will say this, um, automatic knives, illegal in many states, Massachusetts right. included. Uh, so you need to check with your state local laws. Um, I also think you might have to, I don't know if you can just buy this off the website, you might right. have to buy it through a knife dealer because you might not okay. be able to get it in your state. So keep that in mind. We also, this is the launch six. We also have the launch four. The Launch 4. It is the half-size, cute, fun-size version. <laughs> it's a baby. Look at it. it. So, I overall, like it. 4 inches. Yeah. Um, How big is the knife? The blade? It's like an the, inch and the, half bl the blade itself is, is uh, it's 1 and 7 eighths. 1 and 7 eighths. So, it's just about 2 inches. Yeah. Uh, overall, I mean, 4 inches. Who's going to use, who's going to carry this knife? Who's going to use it? You know, I, I think he, we'd be surprised. Yeah. Uh, I think that you're going to find people are going to go towards something like this because nine times out of ten you're doing letter opening, you're doing cut uh, box opening, you're, yep. you're cutting rope, you're, you're, you're kind of doing smaller things. And when you think about it, how much of a blade surface do you really use? You don't. You don't use a whole and lot. You're not sawing. I, I, really. I, we're, not, we're not skinning animals or whatever. I'm, I'm not. Uh, Can I see it? Sure. Wow, um, it's light. 1.8 ounces. Wow. I would put it in my pocket and forget it was there. It's so that uh, the belt clip is <coughs> the exact same belt clip, same length. Yes. And so it rides... Uh, I think it rides even more shallow, maybe. No, I don't think so. I think it looks... Because well, you don't get the tip. The, yeah, you don't have the sharp it's, tip of the knife, um, but you do... It rides the same, but it doesn't reverse. Right. And there's no landing. Because it's so small. Yeah, I the other one doesn't have a landing. Um, this so, would get lost in your pocket, I could see this, but I would definitely, I, I'll be honest with you. I, I would throw it in my truck, my co center console, and have it as a, like a go-to. I, I would carry this daily. I, I I think of when I'm using my knife, right, my everyday carry knife. When I'm working on a job site, I'm working off a utility knife. Yeah. I get that, right? We all use those. But I do have one an, an everyday carry knife, and I don't use the blade. I'm cutting, I'm using the tip to open boxes. <coughs> I'm cutting some twine or string. Yeah, um, simple, sometimes letters. simple applications, I feel like. I. This is everything you need. Yeah. Um, What's this cost? So, it's one nineteen on Kershaw, but again, for high. You people, it's a lot of money. Yeah. Want to venture outside of what you know? I pay like uh, 75, 80 bucks for this. I found it for eighty. Yeah, I'd, I'd do eighty. I think, I'd pay eighty. I, I, for I mean, this. I think eighty is reasonable because, like you said earlier, you're paying for that that auto deployment. Yeah, that's what and, you're paying and, for. And, it, and with this one, the blade's half the size. The 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 shaft, the, the handle is a little more than half the size, but it's balanced. It, it It's smooth and it locks tight. Oh, it, it is super smooth and it's got the black anodized handles again, which lend to the lightness, right. lightweightness. It's got the same, the CPM 154 blade, which holds its edge. It's black anodized as well. One thing I did notice here is, did you, did you see the See the button? I did. I, I was kind of... What do you think about that? Is that That's different um, from this one. So so on the, the 6 here, the, the, the quarter inch button is slightly recessed. Yeah. And for good reason. And I, I think that Kershaw went along the same principle, but they didn't recess the one this one on the 4 enough. So it sticks out a little bit. It sticks out a little bit more. I don't think it's a rivet, huge issue. This rivet does keep does protect it a little bit. But I mean, with me with knives, that's a concern just because it's a sharp object and it's well. I mean, for all intents and purposes, it's near the goods. Yeah. And I do not need <laughs> any surgery done by myself. So I'm rubbing my finger over it right now and I'm pressing hard. I'm not able to deploy it. 
Oh, there we go. I got it on that one. Um, <clears throat> I'm pushing down on the button. So you actually have to pinpoint yeah. that button. So I, I agree with you. It, it does feel like it's it's raised a little bit. Not, but I'm I'm pushing hard, guys. I'm not. I got it there. Um, it's not going to deploy accidentally. It's certainly not going to deploy in your pocket. I don't think so. And this one here, yeah. See, I pushed down on the button to get it. Um, I, I guess it would just be mindful of what's in your pocket. Yeah, or how you're yeah, leaning. Be mindful. I'm I'm, I'm a fan. I think I think again. I think yeah. the price reflects the fact that it's the a really nice fit and finish and and the automatic part of the blade. And I think that even you get though, what even you though, pay for yeah, on this. And, and even though it is like a somewhat of a smooth finish, it's not a slippery finish. No, it's not. No. So that's nice because yeah. you can actually hold it and not have to worry about it kind of losing it. So this is the launch six, launch four. There's other launches, right? There's, There's multiple several. launches from from just what I've seen rather quickly. All different sizes on up. Uh, is this like four, four five, five large? six? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's like yeah. a few in between. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Well, guys, hey, check this out. This is the Kershaw launch six and launch four. And I'm a fan. I like it. I, I'm not so much. Uh, I don't know if I'd go for the big one. I think I like the little one, the Launch Four. I'd like to know what you guys think. Leave a comment. Let us know. What do you carry for an everyday knife? Give us some feedback. Leave some comments. I absolutely love hearing from you guys, and I love your comments. I reply to every single one of them. And please, if you're not a subscriber to this channel, click that red button below the subscribe button. We need your support. Take care and cheers.